going on, guys? It has been a day. Anyway. The uh, same time I got my winter FabFitFun box, I also got something called a Groove Collaborative. This is a giant box right there. See it? <clears throat> I've seen other YouTubers get this box, and I was really interested in it. Um, it's supposed to be only the best natural products shipped to your house on like a uh, subscription base, but you can change how you get your items, which is pretty cool. Um, let me tell you what happened to me. I've wanted to go natural in our house anyway for quite some time. And especially since we have the kitties around and I find that there's a lot of things that make me itchy or I'm allergic to it. I am so tired. I apologize. Oh my gosh. I, quick story. I spent all weekend with my brother making my grandmother's nut roll who she's, she's passed away in 2014 and my brother and I have just kept her nut roll alive. So we made 40 nut rolls. So I am pooped. So today's my day off and I'm trying to get things around the house. I just wrapped my husband's Christmas gifts. So and I'm having coffee for the second time today. <laughs> Mm. Anyway, back to the story. Um, well, anyway, a lot of things really bother me. Sharpies. When I use Sharpies at work, my face itches. So, um, a lot of cleaners around the house actually make me itchy or my hands kind of tingle and whatnot. So, a couple of weeks ago, I cleaned my old ancient shower um, with... A bleach based product um I turned the fan on it was nasty it was I hate our bathroom if you know me in person you know I hate my bathroom it's an old white uh four by four white bathroom with white grout that's just I, I hate it I want bigger tiles so less to clean anyway long story short I clean the bathroom, I turn the fan on, and I come out here into our lazy point and I fall asleep. Now, I'm not sure if this has anything to do with the fact that I used a bleach-based cleaner. Um, but I woke up to my eye feeling wet. And I went like this. And I had blood running from my tear duct. And it looked like almost a blood clot running down my face there was the scariest thing i have ever witnessed i was i don't know what to do so i ran to the bathroom i wiped it all off i had this little piece of blood clot or something of skin or it, it, I don't know, it was like a bloody burger it was a booger it was so gross so i wash it all off and i'm thinking what the hell would have made that happen like that is just bizarre so I don't know if it has anything to do with the cleaner but that scared me enough to just say you know what I am not using any more crap in this house I'm done I'm so done I want to be able to breathe I want to be not feeling itchy and scratchy and then what having blood out of my eyeballs I mean that I'm done so I saw this online um Saw a couple of YouTubers do it, and I was really intrigued by the fact that it was all natural based products. A lot of Myers soaps, I guess. I've seen it in the store. Um, never purchased it though. So, but yeah, I was really excited. I signed up. They gave you a 60 day VIP membership for free. Um, and you get unlimited shipments and I think free shipping. Don't quote me on that. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to keep it. I mean, the subscription part of it. Um, well, I guess it just depends on how much I use the products and how much I go through them. But uh, they have, like, lotions and other things besides just cleaning your house products. So, 
go check it out. Um, it's uh, hashtag Grove Home, and it's grove.co, grove.co. But without further ado, let's crack this giant box open and see what we got. Here we go. And it's so, so heavy. And it smells amazing. Just just the wafting from this box. So I'm excited. I hope I hope it all works. And I can throw away all the other junky cleaners and whatnot. Also, when you sign up, um I believe there's a coupon for you guys. I think I can give you ten dollars or ten percent. I don't remember. It has been such a long day. Um, but there will be something in the description box below. So, um, yeah. Also, too, when you sign up, you get free stuff. Every time you add something to your cart, um, you can add up to a certain level and it'll be giving you more free stuff. And for signing on, you got a bunch of free stuff. So, but without having my computer in front of me, I don't remember what was my free stuff and what I actually bought. You know. So right away, let's see. Got the packing slip here. No, that doesn't tell me anything. Whatever. Okay. Now, this is something that I've seen a lot. Um, it's walnut and cellulose scrubber sponge. Let's see. It. Can you... It's a big sponge. Um, Non-abrasive, perfect for cookware, glassware, countertops, appliances, and top rack dishwasher safe. All right. Awesome. What else we got? Do, do, do. Oh, it's so packed so nicely. I hate to take anything out. All right, we have to. We have to crack it open. I did get one of these. Um, this is just your basic bath sponge, but it's supposed to be made with recycled plastics, and I use one every day. So, see, they have other things besides cleaner. What is this guy? Oh, okay. So this is a glass, sixteen ounce spray bottle. See if I can. Oh, I blurred. There we go. I'm doing this on my phone today. Uh, my camera was just not being nice to me, and uh, I was tired of fiddling with it. <laughs> but hey, the S9 Plus, pretty awesome phone. Just saying. I had the camera before I got the phone. Just throwing out. Ooh. Big glass. There you go. Big glass spray bottle. Nice. Let's see, well, I'm not gonna get it back in the plastic. <laughs> All right. So you got a big spray bottle. Nice. It smells so good in here. I love essential oils. I really do. I love the freshness. A little bit. Wrapped in paper. Nice. This, I believe, is the white plate. Doo -doo -doo -doo. The stoneware tray. Now, I honestly don't have a place for this right now, but hashtag goals. If we ever get a new house. Oh, nice. This was a free item. Yeah. Nice little, nice little dryer. If we do end up building or moving, I will have a decent sized bathroom. Ah, should have taken it out. All right, fiddle with it later. Okay, this is one of the first cleaners here. This is Method, 
which, like I said, I've seen Method in the stores, my local, is it Method? Oh, it's Method and Meyer, both M's. Um, I've seen it in our local grocery store, and I think, I want to say I've seen it in Walmart, but I rarely go to Walmart. This is a daily shower spray, which I thought was pretty interesting. Um, it's supposed to smell like mint. So after you take a shower, you're supposed to spray this on your shower. And it's supposed to keep it clean. Let's smell it. Ooh, okay, that smells really good. I was worried about the mint because I wasn't sure if my husband was going to like that, but I think, I think he'd like that. That's not bad at all. Let's see what else we got. This is the, this is the Method Anti-Back Bathroom Cleaner in Spearmint. There we go. Supposed to smell them all. That smells clean and not like overly terrible. I don't want this video to be extremely long today, so just kind of running through stuff. Um, like I said, the information will be down in the description box, and uh, as I use this stuff, I'll tell you later on in another video how it went. This is Method Anti Back Toilet Cleaner. I was excited about this. You know, you know when you've hit your age, whew, you know you've hit the age as a grown up when you're excited about toilet bowl cleaner. Just remember, you're only as old as you feel. So, soothing, la soothing rosemary lavender bar soap. Now, I've purchased soaps before like this. Um, like go... GoatMilkSoap.com. They're uh, fairly local. Indiana uh, bar soap. Goat milk soap. Oh, this smells good. With the winter here, I've been looking for something um, soothing, comforting. And, uh, yeah. Alright, here we go. Myers. Clean and dry. This is a dish soap. In lemon. Now, I still have, I can't open it. It smells good. I like it. Multi surface lemon. Nice Mars soap there. Oh, here we go. This is Coke. This is Method Body, another Method product. This is, I got tape right here. Coconut Rice Milk Shea Butter Simply Nourish Body Wash. It's naturally derived and no bad vibes. I'm excited about this because I've been drying out and everything that I've been using. Oh, we got we to put this? That's another method. This guy is hand soap. Lavender scent. Again, I have to be careful with the scent stuff. That smells really good, you guys. Like, yeah. This stuff smells really good. Ah, I like it. Getting to the bottom here. Okay. This was... I don't mean to complain. This was very expensive. <laughs> this is, uh, here we go. Focus. Miracle Moisture Cream. People say they swear by it. If it can help me not be so dry. It smells good. Just smells like a regular lotion. Like I said, I will make another video actually using the products and at least give you my, what I say, what I think. 
This is a glass cleaner, and I'm, I'm surprised it's so little. How do you... Okay. So, this is orange and rosemary glass cleaner. You get two of them. Can I see that? Little pinch things. It says to twist off the cap and dispense into a 16 ounce spray bottle, fill with water, and replace and shake. So, now this again is supposed to be all natural stuff. This is uh, something actually from Grove Collaborative. Perfect for windows, mirrors, and other glass surfaces, not for wood. So. Then to the bottom here. This, oh, this was interesting. This is 100% sustainable bamboo and sugarcane tissues. Now, I've seen some reviews on this um, that they're, they're rough. So I'm going to pop these open right now. And we're going to see. Because I thought, you know, even if they're rough, I can use them for, like, makeup or something. Let's see. They do have a rougher texture to them, but if I were to write my nose with them, I think I think they're okay. They're not as rough as some people were saying. <laughs> some people made it sound like these tissues were like sandpaper against your face. That is not the case. They're actually, they're a little stiffer, I'd say, than your average, like, uh, your average Kleenex or Puffs, but they're not that rough. And then, as a bonus, last but not least, you get the cutest little... <laughs> Grove Collective Bucket to put all your stuff in. And I just thought that was cute. It's little. Let's see what we can put in there real quick. Let's see. If I were going to walk around the house and clean. Oh. Oh. Alright. Well. This would stay in the shower. So technically, okay, technically, I could fit three of these big things in here. The toilet bowl cleaner, the multi-surface, and the antibacterial bathroom cleaner. I think everything else would stay. The only thing that I couldn't fit in here would be like the glass uh, swish bottle. But yeah, that is all. So like I said, I don't want to make this too long. We're already going, I think, on... We're already on like 19 minutes. Sorry. I like dead talk and I can't help it. Anyway. That is all. I just wanted to check in with you guys. And uh, show you this new stuff I got. Because I've been wanting to open it and haven't had a chance to. So. I'm going to get to cleaning. And I will let you know how it goes. And don't forget to subscribe. And like this video if you like it. Share it with your friends. And hopefully I'll come up with some more content and fun things to do. I think I've kind of failed Vlogmas. Because I just don't have time to vlog every day. And my uh, video program is finally working. So, so I should be able to post more videos. But anyway, that is it for now. Go check this out. It's pretty cool. See what they've got for you if you want to make your home more natural. And I will see you guys later. Bye. Cheers.